Okay. So I think you know a little bit about our company and what the position is. It's a position for um, medical assistance. So mm -hmm. uh, why don't you tell me about yourself and why you're applying for the position? So over the last few years, I have worked, I have volunteered at um, the Clark House Nursing Home in Westwood. Okay. And I have really enjoyed this experience. Um, and I really like working with kids, but also working with the elderly. And... So yeah, that's all. So what are some of your responsibilities at the Clark House? Um, I have to serve cheese and crackers to the elderly and like play games with them. Okay. So, what um what are some of the challenges of that job? Because that sounds pretty simple, but I imagine there are some more complex elements. Yeah. Right? Um, like bringing them back to their rooms with their wheelchairs, like, and sometimes they like get up. Like, when they're not supposed okay. to. <laughs> and so, so you're, you have to almost assert a little bit of authority. Yeah. Know? Yeah. Oh, interesting. And is that a challenge, or have you gotten used to that? I've gotten used to it, yeah. but I, in the beginning it was a challenge. Okay. As with any good job, you uh, and certainly for this job, uh, it's important that you're reliable, that you're on time, that you're professional. Yeah. Uh, how can I know that you'd be a reliable employee? Um... I'm always on time, and I always do my work 100% and do it correctly. And so who would be somebody that would be able to, to vouch for you to indicate that, that you are all those things? Um, probably, or like, do you mean at the place? Could be at the at place, could be at your school, it could be anywhere. Um, I'd probably say Laura or Elaine at Clark House. Okay, all right, Just that they would go to bat for you and say, yes, she's a reliable person. Yeah. Okay. Um, can as with any job, um, it's important that you have the ability to solve problems. Um, can you tell me about a, a time at Clark House that you had to pro problem solve and how what the problem was and how you solved it? Does it have to be at the Clark House? No, it can be anywhere, really, no. Okay. Um, well, here, there was a problem. Like, I was in homeroom, mm -hmm. and my homeroom teacher didn't see me, and he marked me absent, and then... He was like, oh, she's not in school. He, like, called my parents. And then I resolved it by going to the office and telling them that I was in school. Okay, so you figured out that that would solve all the all the issues around that. Yeah. Good. Excellent. Um, can you tell me about a book or a movie you'd keep with you if you were going to be stranded on a desert island for a long time? Um, I'd probably keep the movie August Rush with me. Okay. Because it's, like, about how this little boy like grows up without a family okay and like it's like I'm lucky to have a family and it reminds you of that yeah oh interesting I don't know that you'd be allowed to have your family on the desert island though yeah so it, might, <laughs> it might be sad um can you tell me about some of your most recent goals and what how you achieve them um can it be in sports it can be anything yeah. anything okay mm -hmm. so some of my most recent goals I'd probably say are, like in softball, mm -hmm. how I won the championship every year. Oh, wow. And then, yeah. And then I'd probably So what did you do, Brittany, to get yourself to, that, to realize that goal? So you wanted to win the championship and you won it, but what, what did you do to win it? Oh, practiced a ton, right. like mm -hmm. every day. Mm -hmm. And then, and like I was a pitcher, so I practiced pitching. I also practice, like, every other position, too, just okay. in case. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. So we have a lot of applicants for this position. Why should I hire you over those folks? Um, I think you should hire me because I would bring motivation and enthusiasm to, your, to this job. Mm -hmm. And also, um, I always do my work, and I'm always on time for the job or to anything. Excellent. So. Yeah. Um, do you have any questions for me? Yeah. Um, I know that you guys are open on Saturdays. Mm -hmm. um, would I have to work every Saturday or would I switch off with my... So we have a rotating schedule. So um, you would probably have to work two Saturdays a month. So the way okay. people do that is they make arrangements. Some people do the first two Saturdays of every month. Some people do every other Saturday and they just make arrangements with the other people on their team. Okay, yeah, that's not Would bad. that work for you? Yes. Excellent. All right, do you have any other questions or anything else? 
No, that's all. Excellent. You did great. Okay. Well, thank you for coming in. Thank you. Very sweet. Nice to meet you. Let me turn this on.